Hey you guys, it's Key. Welcome back to my channel. Now today's video, I'm gonna show you step by step how to turn your headband wig into a human hair half wig. Now, the wig that we are gonna use is a headband wig from Blinklin Hair. They were kind enough to send me this headband wig, so let's get started. So this is what the packaging looks like, you guys. Very cute, very colorful. And this is the contents in the box. Now, this is one of the headbands that came with the wig. And then there was another, two different designs, very colorful. Now, this is what the construction of the cap looks like. Of course, they add a little tag to it. But of course, the construction of the cap came with four combs, two on the side, one in the middle, and then a one in the back. And then of course the headband strap to keep it nice and secure. But in a few, I'm gonna show you guys how to detach that. Now getting started with removing the headband from the wig, I make sure that I look and see where the side combs are and I start where the initial elastic, or I guess you could saw the little Velcro is. I make a little line of where I'm going to start to cut. I try to make it like a few centimeters above the Velcro, not inches, centimeters. That is very important to remember. Now I will take my scissors and I will make a cut right where I made that little white mark. So as you start cutting upward, where your hair should be out, like in a half wig, you're gonna really dig in and start cutting all of that headband off and really make it into a half wig. So anywhere your hair would be, which would be on the sides and in the top on the front, you are going to remove that half wig. The only thing we are leaving is the piece of headband that is attached to the Velcro. So we could pull it back and make it some type of elastic band, if you will, or kind of like a, a drawstring, just to pull it very tightly. So you will angle it down and you will not cut none of that Velcro because of course we need it. So now that you've cut most of the headband off of the wig, I'm gonna show you guys how I'm going to put her on with keeping the straps. So let's get into it. So of course you guys can see the construction of the wig has three small combs. One, two are for the sides, one is for the middle, and then one is for the back. Let me remove my little rollers. I was trying to get this as curly as possible. First, I'm going to put the combs on the front. Then I'm taking the two straps and I'm tying it behind my hair. That's how you keep it snug on the head. Now I'm gonna unbraid my two braids in the front.
Now this is the final result. You guys, I really, really love this headband wig that we turned into a half wig. I love the hair texture. Now they sent me a kinky curly 22 inch headband wig. The 22 inches is 22 inches straightened, not curled. So keep that in mind when you order from this company. But the kinky curly is right on point. Now I have never received a kinky curly that genuinely looks kinky curly. Like the curls are these nice, really cute, tight curls. And I feel like this is a great kinky curly. It's not processed. I don't feel like it was made to be curly. I feel like this is genuinely curly hair that's very beautiful, very soft. Uh, the color of the wig is a dark color. I don't think it's dark black, but I do think it's a dark brown. So that's something to keep in mind if you order from this company. The hair is very soft. When I dipped it in the hot water just to make sure that there wasn't anything on it, it did not drench with any dyes or nothing fell out of it. So that's something to keep in mind as well. I just couldn't put her straight on my head after cutting the headband off. I had to make sure I dipped her into some smoking hot water just to make sure nothing was in it. Um, I did not add any product to this wig. I just, after I dipped it in the hot water, I brushed it with my denim brush. This is what a denim brush looks like. And then I proceeded to let it air dry, of course, upside down. And then I hopped on here to record me putting this wig on my head. I have to say I'm very satisfied with the results in creating this wig. I feel like I could have just worn it as a headband wig because they did give me two cute headbands as well. The presentation of this company was really great. I love the way the box look. It's so fun and cute. And the fact that they added two headbands in and the headband wig was great because of the fact that the actual combs were not on the actual headband. It was on the construction of the cap and that the headband allowed me to get as close as possible to it, to cut it off in the front and still savor the back of the headband so I could tie it on. So that is definitely good. I love the hair texture of this wig. Again, it's a real kinky curly hair which I really appreciate. It's very beautiful and I love it. And I love that I was able to show you guys how to turn this wig into a half wig because that's what we do on this channel. We improvise. So make sure you guys check out Blink One Hair and get this kinky curly hair. I got this in 22 inches and of course it is 22 inches pulled out, not 22 inches curled. But again, this hair is very soft. There's no smell. I love that it's an actual, genuine, kinky, curly texture. So you definitely have to check out this wig. I'll leave all of the information in the description below. Also check me out on Instagram. I will have pictures and I love giving updates in my Insta stories of how certain wigs are going. So make sure you follow me there for extra updates. And also check this wig out. Again, all the info is down in the description bar. Make sure you subscribe, like this video, Comment down below if you decided to try and turn your headband wig into a half wig. Come on guys, let's do it. Until then, I'll see you guys in my next video.